themed live. So um, during my live stream on Wednesday, right at the very end, someone specifically asked for um, a live stream tailored to our feline friends. So I do have Mindy, my cat, with me here today. Usually you see Emmy, who's my dog. Um, but today we will be talking about some really great cat products for fall. Um, so I do have Mindy here with me to be a little model. So she's going to hopefully stay with me for a little bit. Um, I want to talk about, um, I may jump around a little bit just depending on um, how long she stays with me. So um, I'm going to actually skip ahead here and I'm going to get started right away because she is a bit of a shy pet. Um, she is a little skittish. She's a rescue. So she um, likes to just kind of be on her own, roaming free. So we'll see how long she stays with me. And I do have my husband as the cat wrangler in case I need her for something in a little bit. Um, but anyway, I do want to talk about the bath brush first because um, as I mentioned, this is a cat themed live. And I do want to show you something specific about Mindy um, when we're talking about the bath brush uh, before she does run away. So <laughs> Um, you can see Mindy has very uh, long hair, very fine hair, and a ton of it. And um, she is a uh, rescue again, so we don't know her exact breed, um, but she definitely sheds year round. She has very long, fine hair, um, but a ton of it. And um, sometimes it can be really difficult to manage that fur, that hair um, during shedding season. So my cat, because she kind of um, sheds year round, um, I really, really love the bath brush, brush which I do have tagged below and I will show you guys as soon as she does run away. I don't, don't think she's going to stay for much longer, um, but I did want to show you guys really quickly. Um, let's see if I can get her to stay here. She's anxiously crawling over me. She wants to run away. Um, okay, so I'm just going to really quickly. So when you use the bath brush, um, when I do a de-shedding, what I will do is kind of do a circular motion up her fur. And that really helps to gently remove excess fur and hair from the rest of her coat. So this is really easy to do, very gentle. She's actually squirming a little less right now um, because she usually does really enjoy the bath brush. She enjoys um, a regular brushing routine. And because she does have so much hair and so much fur, um, this actually does help regulate her temperature a little bit better, makes her more comfortable depending on the season. So, <laughs> all right, all right, I'm gonna let her down now, but I did wanna just show you that really quickly. Um, I am starting to get some fur off of her so you can kind of see it starting to weave around the bristles here. And, um, just as a point of reference, so my, our shedding season, like I said, she sheds year round, but she does have um, certain times of the year where she sheds a little bit more. So um, right about now into um, October, um, Mindy is starting to lose her summer coat and starting to um, bring uh, in her winter coat, which um, that hair is a little thicker. So these really, really fine hairs, um, when I don't brush her regularly, um, can kind of like float off into the air. They get in our eyes, all over her, our faces. Um, so I do really like brushing her regularly to capture it in the bath brush instead of having them um, kind of on our furniture and our rugs, couches, floors, which requires more cleanup for me and my family. So um, just to show you guys again, a little bit of that fur coming off. And again, I just did it for a couple of seconds, but already you can see that this is working. It's weaving around the bristles to kind of create like a tight mat. So when you do this regularly and you are actually um, brushing her fur. Um, so usually I will lay her down on the floor and I will do that circular motion all along her back. I'll kind of gently roll her over, do her belly, do her other side. Um, so I usually get a ton of hair off of her and the brush actually makes it really, really easy to remove um, when you have, um, when you actually do like a thorough brushing. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to get, oh yeah, it is coming off a little bit. Um, I'm just kind of pinching and pulling from the corners and it is actually coming off quite a bit, quite well. You can see it's um, kind of woven together here. 
And um, all I'm doing is just pinching and pulling all over the brush. And because the hair is woven um, in the bristles, it actually is fairly easy to remove. So you can see all of that coming off kind of in one big chunk. Um, and of course, if you do this for more than like 10 seconds, you're gonna get a ton more uh, hair off of the brush. Um, but I really do love this for all of your furry friends. Um, either, even though we are focusing on cats today, I love the bath brush for my dog, Emmy, as well. Um, um, really great, especially now, again, like I mentioned, during shedding season before your cat uh uh, has their winter coat come in and then in the uh, early summer um, late spring is another time when I really really rely on it it really helps to um, de-shed them um, and make them more comfortable um, your pets will love the bath brush because it's very very gentle um, it's very flexible so it really molds to their body it's not going to pull excessively the hair off of their skin and the bristles are um, very flexible they do not um, they're not like irritating it's a very very gentle so it does a really great job of penetrating through that undercoat to really remove um, all that loose fur and hair um, it works on like I said all of your furry friends so all breeds of dogs cats um, rabbits ferrets gerbils hamsters um, and great for all ages too so puppies older dogs um, because it is so gentle it works really effectively um, it is a bath brush so um, this is great to use wet as well so if you um, are bathing your pet this time of year which I usually stop I use like a waterless shampoo when it gets a little cooler maybe until like October and November but um, I am still doing wet baths right now and this does a fantastic job really lathering up shampoo and conditioner um, because these bristles um, really lather up the shampoo really really well so um, again, same kind of thing. Um, when I use this in the bath with my pets, um, I will gently use a circular motion with the shampoo kind of on the bristles and it penetrates deep, deep down to the skin layer, gently exfoliates your pet skin, um, really helps pull out excess um, fur and hair, um, same as when you use it wet, or uh, sorry, dry, um, and uh, really helps pull out odors, dandruff, all that kind of stuff because these bristles really, really gently exfoliate. So really great options for all of your furry friends. We have a ton of colors. I kind of use the blue one because um, it is a little bit easier to see the fur and hair. So again, I, if you are just hopping on, I just brushed my cat on our live. She did run away. She's a little shy. I'm going to bring her back. Don't worry. But um, we have a ton of different colors. So the blue that I have is actually this one, the exact same color here. It's a true Tiffany blue color. Very, very pretty. It's my favorite one. A lot of stuff in my house is this Tiffany blue. Um, but we have a lot of other colors for um, fall, um, any time of year as well. So if you are into pumpkin season right now, the um, orange one is super fun and red is great for Christmas um, and into like November around Thanksgiving. Um, the bath brushes make great gifts. So if you are looking for something maybe to celebrate your um, pet's gotcha day, their adoption day, birthdays, um, and even celebrating your favorite human as well. Your humans will love these. Again, it makes so easy to really clean your pet during a bath and um, de-shed your pet if you have a ton of fur, if you have a big shedder at home lots and lots of colors. You can really customize your gift to your furry friend or your favorite human, um, just depending on their preference. So we have every color of the rainbow you can possibly imagine. Um, red and orange, of course. We have yellow, two shades of green, these two blue ones, purple, pink, black, and a silver glitter one, which is so fun for the holidays. Um, it really makes you feel like it's snowing outside. Um, so really, really fun to kind of customize 
your gift for your human or your pet. Um, these are all made with the same material. They're a really nice, duff, tough, durable rubber. Um, so it will last you a really, really long time. They all have this great loop so it slides right on your hand. It has these ridges on the back too, so it's not going to slide around too much. Um, and it's um, just really, really great for all of your fray friends. Okay, I see some questions coming in. Um, Grace, hi, thanks so much for joining. Juan, what am I gonna do with so many? Well, <laughs> I work for Bodie Dog, so I am here to tell you about all the fantastic things that we have. And I have so many colors, which I love. Um, I think all the colors are great. I do have a, a cat and a dog, so I am speaking from personal experience with my own cat and my own dog. So thank you so much for your question. If anyone else has questions, feel free to type them out in the chat box. I would be happy to help answer um, anything that you have. So, so I definitely recommend the bath brush. They are fabulous. Um, again, very flexible, safe for all of your furry friends and really, really great for de-shedding, especially as we go into winter. Your pets are losing their summer coat. So you're gonna really start to notice a lot more fur and hair um, on your rugs and carpets as they drop that um, thinner, finer coat. Okay, let me see if I can get my cat wrangler to bring at me, uh, Mindy back because today's focus is on cats. Um, so again, uh, we started with the bath brush because I did want to definitely show you um, how to use it on your cat. Um, and now we're going to bump over to one of my favorite products, which is so fun for um, different seasons as well. It is pet cologne. So if you have never used a pet cologne, this is a great way to give your pet a little refresh, either between baths, if they are just PU, smelling stinky, um, need to make them smell a little fresher, a little nicer. Maybe you have family, friends coming over. It's that time of year, you know, when you have more guests. Um, or if you have just finished giving your pet a, pet a groom, you can use the colognes as a finishing spray as well. And it will leave them smelling like they just left the spa for an extra long time. Okay, here's Mindy. We, ha we are doing a cat focus today. Hello, thanks so much for joining. So I do want to um, see if I can get Mindy to stay with me um, as long as possible because everyone loves seeing cats and dogs and um, I definitely think that uh, people love seeing that I actually am a pet owner. This is Mindy um, and I love all the Bodie Dog products for my cat and for my dog as well. So I am great, thank you, happy Friday. <laughs> okay, so we are talking about pet colognes. The one that I do wanna talk about um, today, kind of focus on, is the pumpkin spice pet cologne. This smells exactly like your favorite fall uh, coffee drink. It smells exactly like pumpkin spice. It's definitely more of a, a spiced flavor. So you can smell the cinnamon, you can smell the nutmeg. It's really, really nice. Oh, so warm and cozy for this time of year. And and um, this lasts a really long time. It's so great for my, whoops, for my cat specifically. She is an indoor cat only. Oh, she's getting squirmy now. All right, we might have to let her go. <laughs> okay, 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 hold on. All right. Uh, my cat is a rescue, she's, so she's a little squirmy, a little camera shy. We'll bring her back in a little bit, but I did want to show you, um, as a cat owner, I love these products for my feline furry friend. My cat's name is Mindy. <laughs> Thank you so much for asking. She's going to run away. We'll bring her back in a little bit, but I want to talk to you guys about the pet cologne. This is so fabulous. Really makes my cat and my dog smell really good. So, I don't know if any cat owners out there, after your cat uses the litter box, they can smell a little stinky. They need a refresh. Um, so I love the pet colognes. My, pet, my cat doesn't need like a full bath. She just has kind of that lingering litter box odor. Our cat owners out there know exactly what I'm talking about. So give your cat a little refresh with a pet cologne. Again, the pumpkin spice smells so great for fall. I really love using this this time of year. It gets me in the mood. Um, sweater weather, you guys know what I'm talking about. Um, all of our colognes are made right here in the USA um, and they leave your pet smelling really great for several days. So um, I wanted to talk about 
uh, length of scent. Um, so with my cat, I mentioned she is an indoor cat only. Um, she, when she wears the cologne, I can usually still smell it on her about a week later. So this is really long lasting. My dog, um, I know we're doing cat focus, but just want to mention for the dog owners out there. Um, she's a very active dog, spends a ton of time outdoors. She runs around, um, does lots of exercise, gets dirty, rolls around in mud and puddles and grass. Um, not quite quite as long lasting as a cat who is only indoors, but I can usually still smell the cologne on my dog, Emmy, um, about two to three days, sometimes four if I'm stretching it later. So really, really long lasting, again, made in the USA. Um, this is not going to weigh your cat's fur or hair or any of your furry friends down. It just leaves behind a great fragrance that you can smell for days. Um, plus they have added conditioners in them. So they're going to make your pet's coat nice and soft and shiny and just leave them smelling so good. So if you love um, cuddles with your favorite furry friend, this is going to make them smell so good. Um, it will make cuddles really fun. All right, I see some people, um, someone needs advice. Tell me what you, what advice you need. I'm happy to help. Um, so it really, really easy to use and you can really customize um, your scent depending on the season or what you prefer. So I know I'm talking about pumpkin spice because it is pumpkin season, guys. But we have other options too. Um, we have 10 different scents available. So we have holiday scents like um, holiday cider right here winter wonderland super fun holiday scents all other scents that i am going to talk about can be accessed using the pumpkin spice listing so if you click in you can navigate to all of the different options um i used actually the winter wonderland earlier today on my dog um she ran outside and started rolling around in the mud and she needed she needed a little refresh so i gave her a couple spritzes of the winter wonderland and um the, when my husband came up and gave her a little scritchy scratchies he said what is that it smells really good and i said oh it's winter wonderland cologne and he loved it <laughs> so i really love doing that for um for my pets uh to just give them a little refresh leave them smelling really good do these cologne do these scents cause allergies in pets so i have not experienced any kind of allergies every pet is different um so you just need to um monitor your pet but it doesn't have any ingredients in that that should trigger allergies um they are uh, a natural product so made with really great ingredients again all made right here in the usa so you can really trust what's in this um it's not going to be filled with a ton of chemicals or anything like that that you can't recognize so very simple ingredients um, let's see five ingredients simple um, so I love that and all the scents are really fun so I know I mentioned a ton of different scents I'm gonna rattle a few of them off here um, pumpkin spice which is tagged below um, winter wonderland holiday cider um, we also have some more neutral scents so if you are looking for something that you can use year-round we have baby powder sugar cookie patchouli um, it's really fun um, kind of more neutral scents or if you are looking to kind of extend the summer season if you're not over pools and beach days yet we have blueberry orange sherbet and lilac which are so great Great. Um, blueberry is one of my favorites as well. It's definitely more of a sugared blueberry. Smells nice and sweet. Um, and all scents, all 10, can be accessed using the listing below. So if you click in, um, it will take you to all of the different options. We also have different sizes available. So I know on screen, this little bottle, this four ounces, will last you a long time. But if you need more, we also have eight ounces and 17 ounces available. So perfect for those multi pet households. Um, if you need a little more cologne, um, if you are interested in trying all three of the holiday scents, which are, like I said, again, pumpkin spice, 
Winter Wonderland and Holiday Cider. Um, you can click in using this exclusive listing below and you can get it get all three for 21% off, less than $30 for all three. That is a fantastic deal. And again, you can kind of customize your pets, uh, your pet's fragrance um, depending on the season and time of year. And that is just really, really fun. So um, definitely check that one out. It is a favorite. I definitely love pumpkin spice though this time of year. Really, really fun. Um, it makes my pets smell fabulous. And um, as they kind of follow me around the house, my cat especially Mindy she is like my little shadow um she um as she like kind of follows me around I can still smell the cologne off of her so she kind of is like my own little personal diffuser um spreading that fantastic scent throughout my house so really really fun again click in on this listing below to access all different scents um Dio where can we get all those that's where you can get them click in there and you can um, navigate and see all the options uh just for you and um may I mention so I talked about the bath brush a little bit makes a great gift um, paired with a cologne you cannot fail with something like this perfect for any pet parent pets gotcha day adoption day pets birthday or if you celebrate the holidays with your pet if you want to do something special for Halloween what is better than an orange bath brush and a pumpkin spice cologne that's pretty cute so um, and of course Christmas holidays whatever um, other things you celebrate perfect for your pets um, they will love it and so will you okay next we um, kind of skipped around here because I definitely wanted to bring Mindy in. Um, let's see if I can get my cat wrangler to bring her back because everyone loves seeing Mindy. Um, but we will get started talking about the next product. That is the Pet Grooming Wipes. Um, so for our cat friends out there, I know I talked about litter box usage, potty habits, that kind of thing. If your cat is getting um, a little up there in age, maybe um, they have some accidents, that kind of thing, um, I really love the pet wipes. So if your pet needs um, a clean after they've used their litter box, maybe they have something on their behind that they need cleaned off, um, pet wipes are a great way to give them a little refresh, clean them off, um, and these are so fabulous. Wipes made in the USA. It is so rare to find a wipe product that is made in the USA. Um, usually they are made somewhere far, far overseas with ingredients you don't know. Um, um, we are very transparent with all the ingredients we may, we use in these. These are unscented and hypoallergenic, so they are very, very gentle for your furry friends, for your cat. Um, and these are also made with um, calming and soothing ingredients. So if your cat maybe gets a little nervous with anything wet, which these are kind of like wet wipes, um, it will calm them down a little bit. So great if your pet, again, needs a little refresh after they use the litter box. Um, if they're behind, needs a little cleaning, um, which it happens. Our cat owners out there know sometimes something is hanging off their hair in the back. Um, or even if you have an outdoor cat, if they like to roam outside in your yard or whatever, give their paws a little wipe down before they come inside. Maybe they're coated with mud. Um, or if you just kind of need to give them a little more of a thorough clean um, other than a cologne the wipe does a really great job of kind of um, not kind of but a really great job of pulling out um, pet odor dirt dander drool all kinds of stuff so really does a great job of um, cleaning down your pet thoroughly this is so easy to use I'm going to show you so this top pops open it has a really great seal these wet wipes um, they uh, really last their moisture stays and retains in this container um, so I have bought a ton of these containers I really love them not only for my cat my dog too I love the wipes um, I use them for a variety of different reasons um, and I have never gotten to the bottom of a container and had like the last few wipes be dry so this really stays wet um, and they do last um, roll out a wipe here so they come in, in this great size perfect for all of your furry friends safe for dogs cats rabbits ferrets gerbils hamsters goats horses any of those furry friends that you have at home again this is nice and durable 
So if you are wiping off your cat's paws, if their claws come out, they won't really rip so easily. Um, if you need to wipe off their face, maybe they've gotten into something. Um, if your cat is terrified of water, like mine is, the wipes are a really great option. So again, nice and durable. This is not going to rip very easily. The material is very soft, will not irritate their skin. Again, this is hypoallergenic. So this is very safe for those pets with sensitive skin. Um, and uh, really deodorizes your pet's coat. So again, that lingering odor can be pulled out with these. Um, and it leaves their uh, coat uh, shiny and soft and conditioned as well. So really easy to use, great size. Um, I know we're doing a cat focus, but um, if you, if your dog goes on walks around the neighborhood, that kind of thing, um, I use the wipes to wipe down Emmy's paws. My dog is named Emmy. Before she comes inside, before she tracks all of that mud, that dirt, that debris, whatever else she's bringing in from outside, into our home. Emmy's allowed on the furniture, so is Mindy. They're my babies. <laughs> they kind of have free roam of our house. So before they leave the little, those little paw prints all over our furniture, I wipe them down, give them a quick clean, a quick refresh. Um, so really, really great. Okay, let's see if I can bring Mindy back. I'm not done talking about the wipes, but um, everyone loves seeing our favorite furry feline friend. This is Mindy, so my little baby. Um, I also use the wipes so if your cat gets a lot of kind of like gunk built up in her ears, these are very, very gentle, safe to use inside the ears, um, very soft, again, hypoallergenic, so it's not going to be irritating for those sensitive areas. Safe to use around the face, just be wary of the eyes. Um, and you can use on all of your furry friends from head to tail. So really great, um, again, hypoallergenic, very, very gentle. If your pets have sensitive skin, if they have no fur at all, it can be used in, on sensitive areas of the body, including the behind, in ears, around the face, all kinds of stuff. So really, really great option. And the wipes are made right here in the USA. Um, we do have a couple different scents available. So if you want something that leaves behind a little nice subtle fragrance, um, again, the hypoallergenic that I have tagged below is unscented so it leaves behind no fragrance but if you're looking something to maybe leave your pet smelling extra fabulous we also have a mango and a lavender um, the mango is also made right here in the USA. That one is extra deodorizing. So like I mentioned, if your cat gets finished using the litter box, if they are um, smelling extra stinky, maybe they just need a little extra refresh, um, that would be a great option. And our lavender wipes are also hypoallergenic. Those and the unscented, both hypoallergenic. Mango, deodorizing. So a little different. Um, the lavender are also made with calming ingredients. So again, if your pet is a little nervous with anything wet, um, our cat owners out there, um, my cat does not like anything wet. So the calming ingredients in the hypoallergenic and the lavender just kind of calms her down, um, allows me to give her a little clean, a little refresh, a little easier. The lavender is also made with 100% cotton. So if you have any pets out there who maybe have like different fabric sensitivities, the cotton might be a great option for you to try. Of course, the hypoallergenic is ultra gentle as well, but if you need something maybe a little extra in that department, the lavender is a great, great option. So um, I definitely implore you to check out the wipes. They are fabulous. Again, I use them on Mindy. Um, she is well familiar familiar with those. Um, I really like using them, as I mentioned, in her ears. Um, sometimes she gets a little something stuck to her behind after she uses the litter box. She is, I'm trying to think now, seven years old. So she's kind of getting up there in age. And I'm sure as she continues to age, she'll need a little extra help. So again, very, very gentle, easy to use for all of your furry friends um, and makes sure that your pet is very, very comfortable. Um, and it's great for baths too. If your pet, um, again, is scared of water, if they will not tolerate going under a hose, um, the wipes give your pet an easy, easy refresh. Hello, Ted. Thanks for joining. All right. I think Mindy's going to leave us again. I just want to show you guys. <laughs> she scampered off so fast. 
Okay, um, we are going to talk about this great product next. So if your cat is a little cantankerous, if she gets into trouble, into mischief, our cat owners out there who maybe um, your cat pat is clawing your sofa, if they're climbing up your curtains or your uh, bed frame or whatever, I have the perfect solution for you. And that is cat and kitten training spray. This is a natural remedy for uh, scratching, chewing and establishing boundaries for your cat and kitten. This is safe for cats age 12 weeks and older, so not to be used on very, very young kittens. Safe to use on 12 weeks and older, our feline friends. Um, this is a three in one, again, so I mentioned uh, scratching, chewing and establishing boundaries. So if you want your cat to stay off, or off of certain furniture, you can spray your furniture down with this. It will create a barrier, almost like a bubble that your couch can sit in, your bed, whatever. Um, this is also great to use on plants. So if you have house plants, maybe that are toxic to cats, you have had to put them far, far out of reach, which I have had to do. I do have a house plant which is toxic to cats. Um, when we first got Mindy, she was chewing the leaves and I was completely mortified, spritzed it down with a couple of this. Immediately she stops chewing, has not gone anywhere near it since. So safe to use on organic, uh, organic things like plants, um, flowers, um, really, really safe for um, any kind of fabric. So if your cat is chewing shoelaces, wires, rugs, if they're scratching your carpet, your couch, you can spray it down with this. Can it help tr keep them off kitchen counters? Um, kitchen counters might be an interesting material to test out because um, it doesn't really get absorbed, but if you spray that area, um, it will maybe linger in the air a little bit and it might help keep your cat away. Um, I definitely love using this on my couch though. So I will spray like down the arm of my couch um, and she will stay far away. So also safe for like rugs. So if your cat um, is like scratching your rug, you can spray down the rug and they'll stay away from it. So it does help with boundaries. Um, so maybe maybe try it. I, I've not, I have not had a customer talk about kitchen counters, so I, I can't say, but I think it, um, it might work. Um, it is made with bitter ingredients too. So when you do spray, this open a window open a door it's very strong hello there thanks for uh, joining um, before you spray this every person every pet is different but um, just depending on your own sensitivities to this it might be a little overpowering now personally I actually kind of think it smells good it smells like um, like rosemary and like a citrus smell so I actually kind of like it um, but some people have um, it have uh, can have more severe reactions to it because it does have bitter ingredients in it which is what is going to keep your pet away from that area um, so really really great great active ingredients 10 times what is in um, other competitive products. This is made right here in the USA, so you know you can be confident of what's in this. Um, plus, it is safe to be used indoor and outdoor. So if you have an outdoor kitty or um, whatever, maybe they like wander in your yard or a certain area and you wanna keep them off of plants or whatever, this is safe to use outdoors as well. Um, again, safe for uh, by uh, <laughs> organic things such as plants, flowers, um, great for, so my cat, she loves to chew wires. So as long as it is water safe, as long as their little teeth haven't punctured through the wire casing, you can spray on the wire and it is safe to keep them away from those. Um, safe to use on clothes. Um, my cat used to love scratching my suitcases. I have a fabric suitcase, so I would spray the side of my suitcase. She since stays away from that. So really great at um, training your cat to, um, to follow the household rules, as I will say. So really, really great. Um, again, made in the USA and um, yeah. I love it. It's long lasting. So when I reapply it, I 
usually, I want to say like I apply it every two or three days. So um, this eight ounce bottle will last you a really long time. But if you have a particularly um, naughty cat, we do have larger sizes available. We have a 32 ounce and a gallon. So it will last, uh, you have tons of options for all of our cat owners out there. Um, really, really helpful. I will say around the holidays. So if you start decorating maybe for Halloween, um, maybe you're like stringing lights your cat's trying to climb up something and claw the lights or um, maybe like Thanksgiving decorations, Christmas trees. Christmas is going to be here before you know it. If your cat is a Christmas tree climber, you can spray this on your Christmas tree live or synthetic and um, it will keep your cat far, far away. Um, Taylor is not on today, just me. Yes, it is safe to use on Christmas trees. So this is safe to use on organic things such as Christmas trees. I have used this on my own Christmas tree. So if you have never tried it, I highly recommend it. My cat used to like bat at my ornaments. They're flashy, they're shiny. My cat would love to play with it. Just give your Christmas tree a little spritz around the base I usually go all around the tree and spray now again don't forget to open a window or a door because this does have bitters in it which your cat will hate but it may trigger some sensitivities with you as well so safety first open a door or window but then spritz around the base of your tree and your cat will stay far far away which is fabulous so again, great for the holidays. Keep them away from pumpkins. If your cat likes to chew pumpkins or other kinds of plants in your house that may be toxic to cats, um, this will stop them. I did use, I have a potted pothos, um, which is a toxic uh, plant to cats. And when I first brought Mindy home, she would chew the leaves and I was absolutely terrified that something horrible would happen to her. So um, I sprayed the leaves and she has since not touched it. So really, really great option for um, cat owners who are just like out of their mind trying to figure out what to do to train their cat, which they are stubborn, but we love them. And we want to make sure that they live a long, happy life. We don't want them to um, have any kind of danger or expensive vet visits from things that they should not be eating or chewing on or scratching. So the um, cat and kitten training spray is just a really, really great solution for all of our cat owners out there. So definitely check it out. <sighs> All right, that is all the new products I have to talk about, but I am seeing a ton of new people joining, um, lots of people with questions. So we're gonna go back through everything one more time in order this time, so hopefully a little less confusing. Um, I did kind of jump around because I wasn't sure how long Mindy would stay on with me at the beginning. Um, I've been able to bring her back with the help of my cat wrangler, my husband <laughs> over here, um, keeps bringing her back so I can show you. She's super adorable, Mindy. Um, my my cat she's seven years old um, and she is my baby along with my dog I do have a dog her name is Emmy as well so um, speaking as a pet parent myself um, I use all of these products in my own home around my own family and I love them they um, uh, most of them are made right here in the USA with natural ingredients, which I love, and minimal ingredients at that. So I don't want to see like an ingredient list with like 30 different things in it. I want an ing a real short natural ingredient list. So really, really great option. Um, Taylor will not be on our live today. Just me, Alex. Hello. All right, so we are going to go back through really quickly again. Um, this time of year, if your cat um, finishes using the litter box, she's smelling a little stinky, she needs a little refresh, um, a pet cologne is a great option. What I have right here is pumpkin spice. So fun for September and October, really gets you in the mood for the holidays. Um, so if you just give your pet a little spritz with this, it will leave them smell extra fabulous um, I really like that it is so easy to use so natural I just give Mindy a spritz or two and because she is an indoor cat the scent does last usually for me personally I have a strong nose so um, when I use this I can smell it on her a week later so it is very long lasting now depending on your pets activity level if they spend a ton of time outdoors um, your results may vary if your cat if your dog or cat or whoever you're 
you're using it on because it is safe for all of your furry friends. If they're rolling around in the mud and the grass, it's not going to last quite as long, but a couple spritzes will leave them smelling nice and refreshed. Okay, so after the litter box, again, you need a little spritz to leave them smelling extra fabulous. Um, just spray them down and it will leave them smelling like your favorite fall coffee drink, pumpkin spice. It definitely is more of a spiced pumpkin. You can smell the cinnamon, you can smell the nutmeg. Smells really, really great. I love using it in September and October. Um, it is so fun this time of year. Um, but if you are looking for more Okay, so I, I see some comments here. Do we have salmon jerky treats for dogs? Yes, we do. Um, if you click in on any of the listings, you can go to our storefront and um, you can navigate to edibles, which is um, treats, any different kinds of things that your pet can ingest. So you can find them there. Um, so the, um, if you are interested in other, um, fragrances, holiday cider is really fun. This is like a spiced apple cider fragrance. Um, and winter wonderland, this smells exactly like a Christmas tree. So, um, I, uh, I know this is cat themed, but we're going to talk about my dog, Emmy went outside, rolled around the, uh, in the grass a little earlier. She was smelling a little stinky when she came back inside. So I spritzed her down with winter wonderland. My husband walks out, gives her a little scritchy scratchies and he's like, what's that smell? That smells really good. And I said, oh, it's winter wonderland pet cologne. And he loved it. So really, really nice fragrances for all of your furry friends. Again, you will love them because it gives your pet an instant refresh. You can use the colognes in between baths or as a finishing spray. Um, so if you, um, after you finish giving your pet a wet groom, a bath, give them a couple spritzes with the cologne and it will leave them smelling fabulous a little longer, um, leave them smelling like they just came from the pet spa and um, give them a little extra pep in their step. Um, and you will want to pet them and cuddle them because they smell oh so good. Um, we have a ton of different fr uh, fragrances available, 10. So you can really customize your fragrance to what you prefer, the season, all kinds of different stuff. So again, I'm talking about a lot of holiday stuff here, but if you want something year round, we have baby powder, we have sugar cookie, patchouli, um, so many different options. We also have um, summer scents. So if you're not quite over summer yet, you're still feeling pool days, summer days, um, hikes outside. We have blueberry, we have orange sherbet, and we have lilac, which are super great summer scents um, that you can use on any of your furry friends. Again, all of the colognes, with the exception of the calming spray, if you click in on this listing, it will take you to all the different options. The calming spray is the only one that is safe for only cats and dogs. All other fragrances are safe for all of your furry friends, cats, dogs, rabbits, ferrets, gerbils, hamsters, horses, um, raccoons, skunks, squirrels, whatever you have at home. Um, you can use the colognes on any and all of them and any age, any breed. Um, so really, really fun. Again, I love the pumpkin spice, really fun this time of year. Um, I, I love it for my dog and my cat. I use it all the time. Really leaves them smelling fabulous. Okay, if you want to try all three of the holiday scents that I mentioned, so that would be the pumpkin spice, the Winter Wonderland and Holiday Cider. These three scents are available in a, bu uh, in a bundle. I've tagged it below. Um, this one is a special deal for our live stream viewers, $29.99. So all three for less than $30. That is 21% off compared to what you would um, pay if you were buying each bottle individually. So really, really fun. Again, you can use like the Pumpkin Spice September into October. Um, then switch to a little holiday cider. Um, smells like warm apple cider. Reminds me of like cozying up with a nice hot mug in front of the fire, reading a book. Um, really great for November. Maybe when uh, Thanksgiving is here, leave your pet smelling extra fresh for when your family visits. Um, they will give you so many compliments. They will instantly want to know your secret. And then moving into December, um, Winter Wonderland. This has a really cute description on the side of the bottle. 
stirs thoughts of a woodsy sleigh ride with a subtle hint of pine fur. So really, really nice fragrance. I love this one. This one's actually one of my favorites because it, it, I don't know, I like like that woody scent. It's really nice. So this is great for the holidays. Um, this one for December, again, September and October, November, December, maybe go back to this in January. So many options. Um, this bottle is four ounces. This will last you a long time. You really don't need a ton of spritzes on your furry friends. Just give them a couple sprays. Um, I have had this bottle, I don't know how long, a long time. And you can see, I, I have barely used any of it. So this is gonna last you a long time, far out expiration date. You can save it for years and years, use it over and over every season. And um, really great for, again, all of your furry friends. All of the cologne scents are made right here in the USA. You will love it and so will your pets. Okay, next. Let's see if I can get Mindy back one more time. Um, she, again, is a shy little kitty. She's a little um, skittish. She was a rescue, so um, she can, uh, she likes to kind of be on her own, running the show, running away. So let me see. Whoop. It's okay. It's okay. All right. <laughs> this is Mindy. Um, so I am a cat owner myself. I use all of these products on Mindy and on my dog cat, on my dog Emmy. Um, so really, really great. As a pet, pet owner myself, I really love the Buddy Dog products. Um, so at the beginning of the live, she's a little squirmy. You might have to put her down. Okay. I just want to show you something really quickly as we start to talk about the bath brush. Now I did this at the beginning of the live as well. So I wanted to show you really quickly before she runs away. Um, my cat is starting to lose her summer coat. Um, she's starting to drop a lot of fur, a lot of hair as she prepares for those cooler months for winter. If your cat is doing the same, I highly recommend the bath brush. This is very gentle, very flexible, will not pull your cat's fur hair. It's ultra flexible, ultra gentle, um, really bends to your pet's body, molds to them, um, so it's, uh, it's safe for sensitive skin. Okay, now before she flees and jumps over me, um, when I do a de-shitting or a brushing, I will move the brush in a circular motion like this all over her body. You can see she's flicking her tail. Oh, she's still squirmy. Usually she loves this when I lay her on the floor and, um, oh, here we go. Oh, she just wanted to lay on my lap. Okay, here we go. So um, I am just kind of gently um, <laughs> rubbing this in a circular motion all along her back and this, okay. Bye-bye. <laughs> um, so I, you can see already, she's starting to really lose that fur, that hair. When I usually lay her down on the floor, she loves it. Um, because this is so gentle, um, it is very, uh, it's like a massage experience for your pet. So um, really great. Again, really helps de-shed your cat. So if you experience like flying hair, if I do not regularly brush Mindy, um, she really loses a ton of hair. Um, the hair kind of like floats in the air. It gets in our eyes, on our face. It's all over our furniture. It's on the floor. It's on our bed. It's everywhere. So this does a great job of capturing that loose fur, that loose hair, so that your um, pet sheds more quickly to acclimate to the temperatures of the season. So like I said, my cat is losing that summer coat. She's bringing in that thicker hair for winter. Um, and she, as I brush, again, in that circular motion, it's going to get through her undercoat, gently exfoliate her skin, spread the natural oils that are secreted by your pet's skin throughout the rest of their coat, which makes it shiny, makes it soft makes it look extra healthy. And it is weaving that extra fur, that extra hair through the bristles. So you can see it kind of sits right at the top, which is so great, makes it easy to remove. So when I do sit on the floor with Mindy, when I do a full brushing of her, um, when I do a full groom, um, I get a ton of fur. Now I wish I had thought to brush her down before I hopped on, but 
alas, next time. Um, but when you go to remove the hair, this is so easy. All you have to do is pinch and pull. Look at how you can already tell it's just very easily coming up. And um, just gently pinch and pull all over the brush. Can you see that? Look how easily that's coming off. And just do that all of the brush. Again, I did not brush her for very long, but I did get a ton of fur off of here. Um, that would otherwise be all over my face. Um, now, I know this isn't a lot because um, I only brushed her for about 10 seconds before she ran away. But if I do like a five minute brushing of Mindy, think of this multiplied by how much. That's a lot of fur that you're going to get off your cat. And look, um, really, really easy to remove. You can see I've really removed all those fine hairs. So really, really easy to brush down your pet. Now, you can use this uh, dry as I just demonstrated, but this is a bath brush. So you can use it wet too if you are brave or if your cat doesn't mind water. Um, this does a great job of lathering up shampoo and conditioner, got a little bit of hair, sorry guys. Um, on the brush, just drizzle a little bit of shampoo on the bristles, run it underwater very briefly. And then again, that circular motion, it is going to lather shampoo and conditioner so well, it's going to penetrate through their undercoat down to the skin layer and um, remove foul odors. It's going to gently exfoliate. So if your cat has a dandruff problem, it will help uh, resolve that a little bit. Um, so really, really great product. Now, the bath brush is safe for all of your furry friends. I know we're talking specifically about cats today, but I do have a dog. Her name is Emmy. I love the bath brush for Emmy too. Um, I really rely on it for bathing her because it just does such a great job. It's going to cut down bath time by a significant, significant amount because it's going to lather so well and so quickly that all you have to do is just like scrub and then rinse off. So so if your pet's scared of water, if they can't tolerate being in the bath for very long, maybe you have a senior pet, whatever. This is going to make it fast, quick, efficient, super great, and it's very, very gentle. It molds to your pet's body. These bristles are very, very soft. It's made of a matte unrefined rubber, so they're going to um, bend, flex, um, to uh, gently exfoliate, again, lather that shampoo and conditioner, and um, it will last a really long time. So this is a nice, like, durable brush last you years and years and years. It has these great ridges on the back so it's not going to slide around when you do this. So you can kind of see I'm like cupping the, the, um, the rim have it around my hand. So when you're bathing your pet in the bath, you know, shampoo, conditioner, it gets slippery. You don't have to worry about it sliding off your hand. You gotta go like rummaging around in the water, in the tub, where to go. <laughs> really, really easy, stays on your hand. Um, really, really efficient at giving your pet a thorough, thorough clean. We have a ton of colors available. So you can really customize what you want according to your own personality, or I'm telling you, these make fantastic gifts. So gotcha days, adoption days, pet um, holidays, birthdays, um, whatever, um, or you can gift it, gift, gift, gift it to your favorite human who has a pet too. I will say, just a little hint, these two, pumpkin spice, orange bath brush, so cute for this time of year. It will be a favorite. Um, but so many different colors. So the one that I have here actually is this one. Sorry. I am using this one because it's a little easier to see the fur um, for live stream purposes. This is this exact brush. The orange that I have been tagging, I apologize, is here, but no matter which of these two you click on, it will take you to all of the different color options. We have red, super fun for Christmas, or even like the changing leaves season. Orange, yellow, two shades of green, two shades of blue, purple, pink, black, and a silver glitter one, which is so fun for the holidays. Um, again, it makes a really great gift and paired with a cologne, it will be a favorite. So click in, um, navigate around, tons of options. We also have two packs available. So maybe you wanna keep one, give one to a friend, or keep one in a bathroom, one in a mudroom, keep separate brushes for separate pets, whatever. Um, tons of options, so make, you, make sure you click in below. The two 
two-pack, I will say, is only $2 more than the single pack, so you're getting the heck of a deal if you check that one out. Um, so definitely click on this one. I love the bath brush. For our cat owners there, again, I really love using it for brushing and grooming. Um, when I brush Mindy, especially when she starts shedding, um, usually when I am, you know, calm, when she's laying on the ground, I will start doing that circular motion. She'll kind of like flop onto her side she'll stretch out she'll start purring she rolls over onto her back sticks her legs in the air and starts purring she loves it again very very gentle so it'll feel like a an exfoliating massage for your pet and the bath brush is safe for all of your furry friends so really really great gift for the holidays we got your day adoption day birthdays whatever so definitely check that one out okay Next are the pet wipes. Um, I did take out a wipe earlier on our live stream, so I will talk about that quickly again. Um, but all um, this one is hypoallergenic and unscented. It is made right here in the USA with natural ingredients that wipe away pet odor, dirt, dander, drool, all kinds of stuff. Um, safe to use inside ears. So if your cat or any other furry friend gets a lot of buildup in their ears, needs regular clean Meaning it is safe to use there. Um, if you have an older pet, they may have some straggly bits after they use the litter box or go potty outside. Um, using a wet wipe is so easy, so quick and efficient that it is a must have for our pet parents of senior pets. So um, again, this is really nice and durable. It is not going to rip, whoops, I skipped ahead a little bit. It is not going to rip. Um, this does a really great job of cleaning your pet off, safe for paws, safe for your entire pet's body, and it is safe for all furry friends. So use after you, for example, I know we're talking cats, let's talk dogs. After you take your dog for a walk, um, wipe down their paws with this so you're not tracking in that mur uh, mud, dirt, all that other stuff that they walk on in the grass, um, on hiking trails, whatever, before they come in, jump up on your couch, track throughout, you know, on your hardwoods, on your rugs, on your carpets. It gets gross. So quick little refresh with the wipe. This is a great size, safe to use on all of your furry friends from head to tail. Now, the hypoallergenic is made with soothing, calming, and conditioning ingredients. So if your pet maybe is a little nervous about anything wet, our cat owners out there, you know what I'm talking about? Um, my cat does not like anything wet. She will not tolerate baths. So I really rely on the wipes if I need to deodorize her, get her clean. Um, maybe she's gotten into something. Just give her a quick wipe down with the wipes. Um, and because it is calming, she kind of settles a little bit. She doesn't try and, she's not like tense. Um, so I really, really love these. Um, again, deodorizes the coat, um, leaves it conditioning, conditioned, shiny, and soft. Um, and it is made right here in the USA. So really great. Um, we do have different scents available. We have mango, which is ultra deodorizing. So if your pet needs like that little extra kick, that little extra oomph to get them smelling fresh, um, the mango is a great option. And we also have a lavender, which is made with 100% cotton. So if your pet maybe is like extra sensitive to certain fabrics or materials, um, this one is hypoallergenic, so it is safe for sensitive skin, but if you want something that's ultra, ultra gentle, the lavender might be a great option too. The lavender is also made with calming ingredients, so same thing if your pet is a little nervous about anything wet, um, that is a great option just kind of soothe, calm your pet down um, to make sure you can get them fully clean. Um, again, these hat come with a great top. This snaps in place really, really well. I have, I don't know how many of these I've bought. I love the pet wipes. I use them for my dog and my cat. Um, it really seals well, comes with 75 wipes. So this is going to last you a long time, but, um, I 
I have not had a single container of these where I've reached the bottom and it's been dry. It's lasted, it's stayed wet down to the very last wipe. So you know that you are going to be able to use every last wipe in that container. Um, really, really great, again, for all of our furry friends, but I love it for cats because, again, cats just my cat especially, hates water. So if you really need um, a way to cleanse them, get them really clean, um, this makes it so easy, so simple. And it's made in the USA with natural ingredients that you can trust. So highly, highly recommend these. I can't, I can't recommend them enough. They're an essential. Um, for our non-cat owners out there, I love throwing them in the back of my car, in the trunk, in my camping pack, a backpack. When I take Emmy um, camping or hiking, or even if we're like walking the um, town trails, um, before she hops back in my car and <laughs> gets it dirty, I will wipe her down with the pet wipes um, to make sure she's clean before my the back of my car becomes a mess so really great and so easily so easy to um to carry with you they're very portable um i love keeping them by the back door so after emmy um my dog goes potty in the backyard i'll wipe down her paws um and again for um our cats because this is a cat themed live today but my cat um is kind of getting up there in age so every once in a while she needs a little refresh after she finishes using the litter box maybe she's got something stuck to her behind and the the um wipes very make it very very easy to just grab it and let her go so very very gentle on pet fur pet skin and um it's just a really really great product that i highly recommend all right next <laughs> For our cat owners out there that have mischievous kitties, naughty kitties, they're getting the things they shouldn't, they're eating things they mustn't, cat and kitten training spray is going to be your best friend. So um, this is safe to ward your cat away from scratching, chewing, and establishing boundaries around things that they should not be on top of. So this is safe for organic things such as plants, flowers, Christmas trees, Christmas is gonna be here before you know it. If your cat is a Christmas tree climber, you can spray this around the base of your Christmas tree and keep them far, far away from those glittery lights and shiny ornaments. Um, I love using this, so I do have a potted pothos in my house, which is a toxic plant to cats. Um, my cat was chewing the leaves. I sprayed this on there and she immediately stopped. So it's not just for your sanity, it also helps keep your cat safe. If they're getting into things that they shouldn't this is for their safety too um, if your cat likes to chew wires as long as they haven't punctured the casing of the wire you can spray it on wires to keep them far away um, you can spray it on couches rugs um, baseboards for example my cat loves clawing she likes sharpening her little claws in my baseboards I will spray the baseboards and she stays far away um, edges of couches, if your cat is clawing those, curtains, um, tufted headboards. My cat is a little adventurer. She loves crawling up to the very top and saying, hi mom, I'm up here. <laughs> um, spray it down with this. It will keep them far, far away. This is a humane spray, so it wards cats away with a scent that they cannot stand. Cats do not like um, rosemary, and that is what this is made with. Um, it's also made with bitters, so um, I definitely recommend uh, spraying minimally at first and opening doors and windows so that um, it will not uh, affect you if you have uh, sensitivities with smells. Um, again, a humane spray to teach your cat what not to chew, um, scratch, or jump, or sit on. So if you want to keep your cat uh, uh, off of certain furniture, if um, you want to stop them sitting on like a chair, um, maybe you don't want cat hair, whatever. Um, just spritz it uh, on that object, safe for a wide variety of fabrics, floors, wood, plaster, um, uh, organic things, plants, wires, anything water safe, this can be used on. This is made right here in the USA, so it has ingredients in it that you can trust. Um, and again, a very simple ingredient list, a very short, 
that long. Not a full bottle length of a, a ton of strange ingredients you don't recognize. Um, and again, humane um, with active ingredients that truly work. It's a natural solution that you will love and bring sanity back into your household. So again, great for Christmas trees. Christmas is going to be here before you know it. Spritz around the base of your tree to stop your kitties from climbing up there. Um, and of course, away from things that may harm them or just causes you to go crazy. So really, really great options for our cat owners out there. This is safe for cats aged 12 weeks and older. Um, so really, really easy and um, effective. It does last a long time. When I spray down the side of my couch, um, I usually have to refresh it every two to three days. Um, this bottle is eight ounces. So if you have a particularly mischievous kitty, we do have 30 ounces and a gallon available if you need more. So um, if anyone has any questions about anything, type them out in the chat box. We're going to wrap up here in a second, um, but we will just do a really quick refresh because I see a lot of new people on here having a uh, We've, we're, we've got a lot of people on here. Okay, so again, for fall, the pumpkin spice is fabulous. I love this fragrance. Um, smells exactly like your favorite fall drink. Pumpkin spice is truly a spiced pumpkin flavor or scent, um, and it's so great for this time of year. I love using it on my cat and my dog. My cat, after she uses the litter box, um, she can get a little stinky. She needs a little refresh. Just give her a gift your cat a couple spritzes of this um, and it will instantly instantly leave them smelling fabulous um, all cologne scents are made right here in the USA 10 cents available so click in below to see um, what you prefer um, we have some holiday scents available including um, holiday cider and winter wonderland so you can get all three um, tag below exclusive for our live stream viewers, less than $30 for all three, which is 21% off compared to what you would um, pay if you were to buy them individually. All um, cologne scents, again, made in the USA, makes a super great gift paired with the bath brush. Um, very flexible, gentle, molds to your pet's body, very gentle bristles that will be non-irritating, effectively de-sheds your cat, dog, or any other, other of your furry friends. Let's see if I can get Mindy back here. Oh, here's Mindy. <laughs> this is my cat, Mindy. She loves the bath brush. Um, I really rely on it to help de-shed her when she starts losing her summer coat and her winter coat. So she has two shedding seasons, one now and then one in um, late spring, early summer um, to really help her acclimate to the changing seasons and temperatures. Um, your pet will love it because it's as gentle as can be, safe for sensitive skin and, <laughs> all right, she's done. Um, feels like a massage for your pet. Tons of different colors available. Um, orange, of course, super fun during fall. Paired with the pumpkin spice bath brush makes a fabulous gift um, for your pet's gotcha day, adoption day, birthdays, holidays, even for your favorite humans. Um, holidays and birthdays, they will love it and it will be a favorite. Okay, tons of color options. Red, orange, yellow, green, two shades of blue, which I do have here. Um, the aqua here is my favorite. I do have it tagged below. Um, purple, pink, black, and a silver glitter one, which is so fun for the holidays. All right. Um, safe for all your furry friends too. The wipes hypoallergenic, super gentle on your pet skin, unscented, made in the USA, makes it really easy to give your cat a bath. So my cat hates water. Um, I will just give her a little refresh with the wipe. Very durable, will not rip. The um, container contains 75 wipes, so this will last you a really long time. Um, and it effectively wipes away odor, dirt, dander, drool, um, 
grime in ears or um, cleans up their behind after they use the litter box and they've got a little extra dribbles. So safe for all of your furry friends, very gentle, hypoallergenic, um, also made with calming ingredients. So if your cat gets a little nervous with anything wet, this will help calm them down as well. Couple different scents available. We also have a deodorizing mango, which is um, it kind of gives that little extra kick if your pet is extra stinky. Um, and a 100% uh, cotton lavender one as well. Um, so definitely check those out. So great for all of your furry friends, safe for paws, head to tail, behind, inside the ears. Um, safe to say to use on any of your furry friends, whether they have fur or not. Throw in the back of your car, in the back of a backpack, keep by your cat's litter box, um, in a mud room, whatever. And last but not least, the cat and kitten training spray. Again, this is a humane, natural spray that keeps your cat away from things they should not be chewing or scratching or sitting on humanely. So this is made with natural ingredients, 10 times the active ingredients, so it's super effective. Um, if your cat is clawing your sofa, climbing your curtains, um, if they are climbing up your tufted headboard, like my cat does, um, if your cat is chewing plants that are toxic to them, Frank, I have the solution for you. It is cat and kitten training spray. This is made in the USA. Um, ingredients all sourced right here in the USA so you can trust what you are using. It is uh, It wards your cat away with a scent they cannot stand. Um, it does have added bitters in it, so if your cat does try and chew a little bit on it, they will immediately run away. They hate the taste. Um, I have used this also on organic things. For example, I have a potted pothos at home, which is toxic to cats. My cat was chewing the leaves. I sprayed this on it. She immediately stayed away. So this is not just for your sanity. This is for your cat's safety as well. Um, if they are chewing things like toxic plants, if they are chewing flowers that are not safe for cats, if they're chewing wires, the, um, this can be used on all of those as long as it is water safe. So on those wires, as long as they have not punctured the outer casing, this is safe to spray on there to keep them far, far away. Um, safe to use on shoelaces, um, baseboards, wood, carpet, floor, um, couches, blankets, pillows, anything that they should not be chewing or scratching or sitting on. Um, this will ward them away. Really great product made in the USA with ingredients you can trust because they are also sourced right here in the USA, three in one. So again, cat uh, scratching, chewing, boundaries. Really great to train your cat the easy, humane way. <sighs> All right. We went through everything, I think, three times. Um, we still have a few people on, so if you have any questions as we wrap up, type them out in the chat box and I can get them to, I can answer them as we wrap up here. So type out your questions. I am happy to help um, as we wrap up here. So again, so many great products for all of your furry friends, but especially for cats. Frank, I think you were the one on Wednesday who asked for a cat-themed one. So let me know if you have any questions if you have anything that you specifically want a solution for, and I will be happy to answer. Um, so my own cat, Mindy, she is a seven-year-old rescue. She is my little baby. Um, I do have a dog as well. So all of the products here that um, I am talking about, I use in my own home on my own pets. I love them for my cat and my dog. Um, they are just absolutely fabulous. The majority of them are made right here in the USA. Um, the ingredients are sourced right here in the USA. So I really trust them. And again, I use them in my own home. So I really, really really love them. Um, I am definitely more conscious of ingredients and that kind of thing. So um, if you uh, need to look a little further at them, um, let me know. Again, really, really great ingredients. So 
Um, if you have any questions maybe you don't want to ask in the chat box, um, you can reach out to us on social. We are at the Bodie Dog, the Bodie Dog, all one word, no spaces, no underscores, nothing fancy like that. Um, we are on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, TikTok, LinkedIn, Pinterest, and Twitter. So you can reach out on any of those platforms, send us a DM. Maybe you want to take something offline, you don't want to share with everyone else on Amazon. We're happy to help figure out what would be a great solution for you and your family. Um, send us a DM. We love to, um, we love to help out. Um, also we do a lot of live streams per week, just depending on availability, sometimes between four and six. So if you love content like this, if you want to know more about dogs, cats, rabbits, ferrets, any of your furry friends, we have so many products over a hundred that are safe to use, um, on all of them. So give us a follow somewhere below below the carousel should be a follow button. If you click that, you can be alerted to when we go live in the future. And um, we will be talking about kind of a variety of project products. We are kind of transitioning more into fall stuff right now, fall and holiday, as we are now in the burr months, September, October, November. So lots of fun stuff for fall and winter coming up. Um, we have a ton of stuff going on on social media too. So lots of challenges, a chance to win prizes, so many fun things. So make sure you give us a follow on social media as well. All right. I think that's all I have. Um, if anyone has any lasting questions, now's your time. Now's your chance. Um, but if, if, um, if not, thank you so much for joining me this Friday evening. Um, I hope you, uh, give us a follow and we will be back on Monday to talk about some more pet products. Um, I think we probably will transition back to dog stuff. Um, and then do, I kind of like intersperse them. Uh, so we, we talk about about cat stuff we talk about dog stuff everything that I talked about here is safe specifically for cats um, but we have stuff for all of your free friends like I said so really really great products um, the majority of them made in the USA um, ingredients sourced in the USA we are a family-owned business as well um, so we love hearing you uh, from our customers feedback whatever so reach out to us um, we love to hear from you all right, I think that's it. I, I tried to give a few extra minutes to see if anyone had any questions, but it doesn't look like anyone has any. So I am going to say goodbye. I hope everyone has a really wonderful weekend and we will see you again on Monday. Bye guys.